So here we've got approximately 120 meters to the green, and I'm in an easy spot. Okay, I've got my six balls set up. If you don't get a chance to get on the golf course, you can do this on the driving range. Often there's greens out there. If not, you can pick a couple of points, usually distance markers as well. 120 meters approximately. You work out your golf club, which one you're going to use. It's going to vary as well from day to day. Okay, so if there's some wind, if it's warm, if it's cold, you've got to bear a few things in mind. If you're stiff and you haven't warmed up, you're going to you choose a different club from uh, different times that you do this. But we're still going to record the result. An easy position. Okay, we're not in a tricky spot here. I've got big gap in the middle there, bunkers left and right. I'm going to hit these six balls, thinking about my posture, maintaining that posture, careful not to be lifting or dropping during that swing at any point until you've swung through, until you've committed. So we get that weight shift, we're hitting down and through, committing, then we can lift and look. Okay, so especially as we get these shorter shot it, shots, get nearer to the green, it is easier to look up that a little too early. So I managed to pop that one on the green, so I'll do those six, like I say, from the easy spot. My next six are going to be from a harder spot, more difficult uh, situation. So in the semi-rough, possibly with some trees in the way to make it a little tricky, not too difficult. Be realistic about it. Um, make sure you still have got a chance of getting the ball on the green. So just make that next six a little harder and record your result.